I'll talk about the vertebrate. We have talked about vertebrate. We have, we have been dealing with vertebrates a lot in this session today. C. What is the question? Does it have fur? What can be the answer? Just say, think about the question. The question is, does the, the organism, okay? For, suppose you have got an organism, which is a vertebrate, right? Does it have fur? The answer can be just two things. Opposite, right? Yes or no? See. Yes or no? Now, what will you do? See. If it is yes, that means it's a mammal. But if it is no, then you have to move on to the next question, right? What is the next question? Does it have feathers? What will the answer? Again, two. Yes or no? Opposite. Correct? If it is yes, then it's a bird. If it is no, then you have to ask the next question, which is, do they have a dry skin or do they have a moist skin? Now, if they have a dry skin, they are the reptiles. Fine. If they have moist skin, we have to next ask the question, do they have scales or do they don't have scales? See the answers. If they have scale, scales, they are called the fishes. They are the fishes. And if they don't have scales, they are the amphibians. See how simplistic this method of key is and how just with the on the basis of some questions, you can identify and categorize organisms, right? So this is the key. 